Novena to the Christ Child. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for our sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord. He was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin Mary. He suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead. On the third day, he rose again. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Open my lips, Lord, and my mouth shall proclaim your praise. O God, come to my assistance, Lord, make haste to help me. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. Sweet Jesus, Savior of mankind, you have graciously dwelt with us. You long to be with little children, for you once said, let the children come to me, for of such is the kingdom of heaven. Lord, let us come before you. We kneel and pray to you that you have mercy on our sins and frailty, and that you would give us grace and mercy, which we long for from our small and all-powerful hand. At this novena, we are striving to let others know of our lovable image, and we pray that you give us light and grace from heaven, which will enable us to remember the sweet passing of your divine childhood. And those thoughts are combined with the powerful prayers of your mother Mary, who will reveal to us and cause us to love you in this veil of tears. The ninth day, the obedience of Jesus. Picture in your mind before the child Jesus when he left the temple of Jerusalem and went back down to Nazareth with Joseph and Mary. He remained there 30 years of obedience to them. When the child Jesus left his parents for three years and was found in a temple, he taught us that we must be obedient to the will of God and must put aside love for ourselves, for ourselves if it does not conform to the will of the Most High. But when he returned to Nazareth, we are told of nothing more than that he was subject to Joseph and Mary. He wanted to show us that it is blessed to be obedient to parents and those in authority because it is good whom we obey in them, who are his representative in the end, obeys God who is in heaven. But he who does not obey God's representative on earth disobeys God himself in heaven. For it is true that parents and those in positions of authority are not to abuse their use of authority, commanding evil. Disloyal, rebellious man who does not like to obey, who does not like to be a subject. But if we are to see the Son of God who became a child and obeyed his mother Mary and his foster father Joseph, how much more must you become obedient? Si Maria esta que now man must solve it. O do us na pelegri, no sukuma gigi da hami. Da mo da da go. Come on. 
O wisdom who comes from the mouth of God, the Most High, who reaches the beginning and end of time, guiding creation with power and love. Come, teaches the paths of knowledge. O God who became a child, you said, he who asks will receive. Give me what I ask of you before your image. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. O God, who became a child, you said, He who seeks shall find. Let me find the good that I seek, because I know that it is in the closed palm of your hand. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. O God, who became a child, you gave word to the people that he who knocks will be opened unto. Listen to me knocking at the door of your merciful heart. Open for me so that I may enter and stay with you forever. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Sama na iri galuni wa 
Let us pray. All powerful and eternal God, Lord of heaven and earth, who was seen by the small ones, we ask you to lead us to the true belief of our child Jesus and to follow your will in our lives and to enable us to reach your kingdom promised to the poor in spirit. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Jesus became man like us, and he gave us himself up to death, who delivered us by his death who earned his everlasting name. Blessed be the name of the Lord, now and forever.
O God, who sent your only begotten Son and to save all men, and who was named Jesus, please give us the grace to honor his name on earth and to please you in heaven because of his coming. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. This special presentation of the Novena to the Christ Child is dedicated to the memory of Wakin Conception, our beloved Uncle Kim.